Today we're gonna be looking at Minecraft RTX again. And before we get into that, you might be wondering, why are you looking at the sky right now? Well, that brings me to the first thing I wanna look at, which is the mirror block. It reflects everything uh, for some reason besides your own character, unless you're in third person mode, whoa. Okay, that looks that looks very cool. I don't know why I don't exist in first person, but yeah, that's, that's besides the point. The point is we have mirror block. If you guys have been looking at Minecraft ray tracing for a while, you've probably seen those mirror rooms. And yes, I'm making a mirror room because I wanna see it for myself. What's interesting is it reflects the mirror that's over here, and this reflects this mirror that's over here. And there has to be a limit to this or else, you know, the game will just explode, my graphics card will blow up in a fiery death, and I can't make videos anymore. All right, we're almost encapsulated in the mirror room. As you can see, slowly but surely, oh no, it's disappearing the light. This is so cool. Almost done, I think. I don't know, I can't actually see. This is what the inside of a mirror looks like with absolutely no light. This is trippy, dude. This is the only... Yeah, that's the, that's actually outside. So all of these windows that you see is just a recreation of this right here, which is just absolutely insane. I love this. I want to put lava in here somewhere. The ground. What? I thought lava glow. Why don't lava glow? I must have the wrong resource pack on. Hold on. I think the most impressive thing about this is how shapeless the block is. So if there wasn't an edge to it, you really couldn't even tell that it wasn't the world itself. But I don't know if you've seen mirrors in other games like GTA. It's just a terrible recreation of what's reflection. And this is seems almost like it is the exact thing that is on the other side. Nearly no distinction, which is crazy. And stepping into the mirror, you just get this amazing effect. So I switched up the texture packs here and I, I do actually have lava, as you can see. I put it literally right next to it. Look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think it duplicates whatever it sees seven times. What's burning? You see that effect? Oh no! What did I do? I didn't mean to do that. Okay, whatever. It doesn't exist as long as I'm inside this mirror realm. It's such a beautiful landscape of infinite lava pool. Ah, oh, it's just so, so cool. I love it so much. Chicken. Chicken. Oh no, dude. I was gonna make infinite chicken. All right, no more lava. Oh, we have different types of torches. Soul torch, redstone torch, right. I wanna try a little bit of all of these and then I wanna make infinite Steve. Ooh. This is so weird. This is probably the most bizarre experience that I've ever had in a video game. I must say, it's just very, very impressive what they've been able to achieve here with, with these ray tracings. It's so cool. Oh, this is so trippy. It's kind of hard to tell how many uh, torches are left. This is scary, dude. Steve, <laughs> the third person mode is so awesome. If I could get like a good light source in here somehow, then all you would see is infinite Steve's forever. I want that to be the thumbnail, so we're gonna have to figure it out this video. Oh, that's so beautiful. To the light. Oh, it looks so weird going in and out of the... Whoa, dude. Ray tracing is a, a technology that I can't wait to see what actually happens with it. Even with a high-end card 3080, I'm still getting 130 frames with ray tracing on. Granted that it is Minecraft and other games are, you know, not as optimized as Minecraft, but it's still pretty good. Not gonna lie, bro. Pretty good. Why can't I step in this? Did I break it? There we go. This is moody. It's not, it's not good enough. We don't have enough Steve's in the frame. The, is this the shot? Oh, this could be better. This could, this could be better somehow. I know this is it. This is the money shot right here. <laughs> this is so cool. So yeah, you can add as many lights as you like uh, to this. I, I think I'm just gonna go in and see how crazy we can make this. Uh, so this is what Perky's Horde basically looks like. Subscribe and comment for more. Ooh, that's some, that's weird. There's some residual orange color from the lights. Is it like slowly disappearing? That's so odd. Do you see that? It like slowly fades away. This is very interesting. Oh, I know what we can do. Pig. This is scary. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> he kind of disappears after a while. I don't know what that's about. If I'm not looking right at him, he doesn't exist. What is that Minecraft, huh? Come on, man. I can't be doing this. I actually get a frame drop when I'm in here. Only a hundred frames. And then as soon as I, I go outside of it, I get like 
like a hundred more frames. It's very intensive in here generating all these pigs. I, I get it. I get it. Don't worry. Whoa, you see that? What is going on? There's something going on here. I don't get it. It's kind of bugging out a little bit. That was really cool, whatever that was. So I'm going to lock myself in a chamber. Pretty sure. Yeah. Th this little design here is a lot smaller now. Isn't that weird? I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but that's, that's really strange. Uh, oh, no. Steve's like in a kaleidoscope. <laughs> no, no, no. I want this. There we go. And then this. What? This is very weird. <laughs> I don't know if I like this. Oh, this is cool though. Steve, there's someone behind you. This is such a weird thing. I never thought this was gonna be possible. Like growing up, I never thought that technology would reach this point. This is just scary. This is very, very scary. Uh, he's still in here, wow. Get out of here. <laughs> so from the looks of it, it doesn't duplicate particle effects. As you can see, we have particle effects up here. Nothing down there. So that's kind of weird. But like anything else, we can just literally duplicate this portal a million times by putting mirror blocks in the top and the bottom. Now we have a really long portal. <laughs> Ooh, ray tracing nether? This is sick. So many particles though, I'm not a big fan of that. Holes in mirrors, very, very strange. This could make some seriously strange droppers. You know what I'm saying? You know, remember those where you fall through them? <laughs> Just for example, I made this short dropper. You thought I was gonna keep going, didn't you? Yeah, it's because I got really lazy and I really didn't make it that tall, but you get what I'm trying to say. It looks like I'm gonna fall forever. Ooh, this is, uh, this is odd. There's some really cool illusion effects that you can do with these mirrors. As if it looks like I'm in this huge room that's really tall, but actually it's just a one by like, 10 mirror tower and but when you go inside it looks like you're uh, in such a bigger place and it's just very satisfying to look at i think somehow <laughs> it generates this which uh it's just amazing i love this such a cool thing and it's not just like in minecraft this is technology that can be implemented in almost any game that's what really gets me excited i think minecraft is a good base test for like rtx because it's so new and it's really powerful but minecraft's really like low end when it comes to processing so it could really take full advantage of these crazy generation effects that that's going on here and this by the way is literally just one block i can delete it and uh now we got fire <laughs> uh or we can we can have whatever this is yeah that, that's really strange i don't know what that is interesting just making some small breaks in the side of the tower gives an absolutely distorted effect as if you're falling through reality. It's great. I don't know what else to say about it. It's great. So I just wanted to show you guys that it wasn't really a long video. There's only so much we could admire about mirrors and lights and so on. But I hope you guys enjoyed anyway. If there's any other breakthroughs in RTX lighting, you guys should let me know down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I will see you in the next video. Later.